it does do, we is our be back at it, but ha yet da again. Blacked out a little bit there. Apologies. Sup, sup. What it does do, bro. Sup, sup. How's it been this weekend? Yo, bro. I can't get this much better. Apologies, bro. Apology. Nelson won't close it. We let him outside one time. He saw a squirrel, bro. He's been crying like a child the entire time to go back out for two weeks straight. So over the weekend, we got one of those like dog leashes, whatever. And we like put the stake in the ground, put Nelson on the leash. So that he would get like roaming room. He like did like a backflip 360 heely kicky flip and got out of his harness. Oh, yeah, yeah, bro. He's so, sp dude. And I, so if you guys recall, back in, back in the old crib, he would sit there and cry at the door. And I would, I would have to get up. Then I'd let him out and he'd come in. Then he'd get up. Then he'd leave. Then he'd one in. Then I went out. Went, and remember, I was losing my freaking mind. Do you remember? Right? And it was good for about a month here. And he got one taste of the outside life, and now he's going crazy. Mittens is fine. Theo is fine. These guys love this house, blah, blah, blah. They love it. We have a deck. We let them on it, but the deck's not enough for Nelson. Anyway, sorry. Sup, sup. What it does do? We back. We back. Beautiful day today. Guys, we also have another problem, though. Apparently, the clock is turning soon, like around Halloween. Guys, I also forgot about how depressing that was. Do you recall? Remember last year when the, the, that, the sun, we lost, it was like, I was streaming in darkness the whole time? God, life's so challenging. But anyway, my lift today was great. We did upper chest. I'm trying something a little bit different, doing a little bit lighter weight. Because my whole philosophy is, right now, if I'm not, like, struggling, it ain't a good lift. But it, you don't have to struggle for it to be good. So I did, like, bench, whatever, like, eat light, like, 275 for three sets of eight. Like, really light, blah, blah, blah. Did all that. Um, I got my loot box for my mom today. Also, I got an update on that, actually. So I don't think you people realize what my mom does, like, when she makes me all this food. Like, it's a, like, anyway, I got an update. My mom, the cookbook is underway to see what I eat on a weekly basis and how she makes it. It's been started for a couple months now. And we're also thinking about filming with an actual crew a day, a uh, day in the life of my mom when she like delivers my food and makes it if you guys didn't know my mom has been making my food she's my own personal chef for the last i don't know two years so she wakes up on like sunday people don't understand the process she wakes up she sets everything up sunday night and then monday morning she makes seven meals at the same simultaneously she makes seven meals and then drives four hours and drops it off here. But like the process that she does that, people don't understand like how hard it is and everything she does. So we're thinking about releasing a day in the life of my mom, of a, like a, of a Monday of my mom, when we drop the cookbook. Like how f five head is that? Is that just crazy? Like, when, I, bro, people want my mom's cookbook so much because at TwitchCon, excuse me, oh, there's a school bus. I forgot you children have school. Because at LCS Finals, I had like eight people come up to me. Where's your mom's cookbook coming? I guess because I all I eat on stream nowadays, except for like Friday. So anyway, that's happening. Um, look forward to that. And who knows how long that's going to be. And then also, my weekend, I don't know, bro. I didn't do anything. Me and Kayla went to an arcade or something. It's called like the main event or something. And I think I threw out my shoulder. Not making excuses for the day. I'm just saying. I, th I threw out both my shoulders. Because they have those, like, uh, you know the, the game where you take the ball and you, like, throw it and knock over the clowns? Or, like, a football and you throw the football and you try and uh, put it in the hole or whatever? Bro, I'm talking. I was, I was, <laughs> I don't know why. I, I felt like being a rug rat. I'm talking. I was getting a running start to the thing. Right, bro? Like, I'm talking, I was getting a running start to the machine. I was fucking sending that shit as hard as I could. It was obnoxious. Fuck, I should have got kicked out, I think. I do not care, bro. So anyway, not making excuses, but I threw out both my arms. Both of them. So if I, I play poorly today, that is why. Other than that, though, 
I ain't do nothing, dude. We got big things happening. I got a busy October. Also, actually, it's not all I did this weekend. Remember on Sunday, bro, I was like thinking, dude, I was so bored on Sunday. I was like, what am I going to do? Dude, I need another hobby. My hobby was cleaning the pool. But how much of a hobby is that? And then I, I, like, times are like really like, I don't play other, people, because people don't know, I don't play other games off stream or anything. So I, I was like, ooh, looking around at my desktop, I was like, oh, there's, look, H1Z1. I loaded H1Z1 up, bro. <laughs> bro, just for like, like, at like 12 on Sunday or whatever, I loaded it up. Dude, I sat in a one person lobby for 40 minutes, 40, 45 minutes. Eventually, two people connected, right? So, and the game started with three people. At that point, I was just like, damn. Like, bro, why are those servers even still up? How does the, bro, who's paying for the servers? Bro, imagine being a dev. Like, it's really hard for games to completely die nowadays. It really is. Because dumbasses will invest money and play forever. But, like, dude, imagine a game being from how big H1Z1 was to 45 minutes for the three-man lobby. What the hell, bro? I don't know, dude. I won the game. I two-tapped two people with Kayla watching in the background. I'm him. I'm him. Straight up, bro. Soon with League, bro, you don't understand how hard it is. Because H1Z1 was like one of the most popular games, and for it to go to three people. How is that possible? How? Anyway, that was my weekend. That was my day so far. Let's, uh, let's ruin it all. Last week sucked. Last week did suck. I remember that. Oh, we're master tier now. Holy shit. Oh, my God. Am I washed officially? Is this how it ends, bro? We were GM for two months, exactly. Two months and a couple days. Now I'm master tier. Uh, we got the... Uh, let's see how today is because, like I said, we did have that talk with Riot on Friday. Friday was a little bit better. Let's see how it goes. Pretty much putting... I need to go exhaust. Fuck. I'm not gonna go exhaust, but... And also, maybe I should start banning MF. Leaving graves open. I don't like playing against MF. I don't care. <sighs> hey, let's see what happens. So, uh, the reason I stopped even using exit lag is because it stopped lowering my ping. I don't know why. It was just... It, it wasn't even a new patch. Just... Maybe it was a Windows update or something, but it... it so, it was lowering my ping by, like, 9. So, it was taking it to, like, 29. So I stopped using it. Somebody said that it, the servers are perma on or something. They didn't give them that bounce as well. Nice. I'm him! I'm him! Wait, she didn't do a single point of damage to that freak? What the fuck? Crazy how this game's gonna turn out when Fiora collects that bounty. Uh, I think we chill him.
Hey! I really had a W away, man. Are we serious? Just no fucking damage to be found? I'm seven. Like, they're one kill. This guy's doing the little shimmy. Oh, better just played a little bit slower, but that's bad. Fiora is suffering from an illness, poor guy. Oh, I shouldn't make fun of him. That's probably gonna be their best game. Might as well fucking toss it out there. Give us feedback. Oh, is it the same fucking survey, man? Oh, this one says it'll take 10 to 15 minutes to complete. Yeah, you're not getting that out of me. Pay me. Pay me. Do your goddamn survey. What do you mean? Yes, uh, maybe I'll take a 10 to 15 minute survey for free, actually. Kayla bought Halloween decorations. This is what she bought. <laughs> What did you do? To, guess how much this was. Why did you buy? This guy's head isn't even facing the right way. His arms are backwards. What is the abomination? It doesn't even make, like. <laughs> no, Kayla wants to buy. It was like 200 bucks. 300, Kayla said, right? Yeah. Kayla's going to decorate the house for. Uh, for I can't even. I, I can't even say it. Like, But, bro, what? <laughs> it's not. That's one decoration. Like. Gonna put it in the front yard. If you guys were trick or treaters, would you like going up to this ha to a, a house with this in the front yard? Six feet tall, she says. Would you guys like it? You guys wouldn't care, would you? 
Just walk up to the house. You, you just want the candy. You don't care about decoration. You just want the candy. Isn't that full of candy? She said she could fill it with candy. Little kids will like it. True. I mean, I'm down to go Scion again. The thing about Scion is... I'm going Scion. But this game, I'm not going Scion because I want to go Scion. I'm going Scion. So my team checks my OP.GG, sees my Scion match history, and dodges. Oh, y'all. This is the only decoration she's gotten that I like. Fall, y'all. I was saying it all weekend. Fall, y'all. Fall, y'all. That's the only one I like. Actually worth the money. Actually. Uh, maybe we, uh, I don't know. Look a Mumu there, bro. y'all Ooh, that was actually close up off me dog Larry lurker oh Larry oh he's all chatting let's go Did Akali's much better? Yes, this Akali was shit talking. Yeah, bro, Akali's much better. This guy, this guy was calling Katarina cringe. Thanks 
you're coming back, bro. I fucking told you I'm him, bro. Him. My god, bro, whatever. Hubby says she'll R the Jarvan out. was a man of their word. Fucking streak. What we'll, we'll about that 27? Still gonna sub though, thanks. I'm not kidding, guys. You're gonna see Scion Bot played at Worlds. Just know I invented it. First pick, Puggers! Pike Man? You know what time it is? I did spiritual. I forgot to press go live. Show you how bad Cinna is, dude. The lose to my. Nice, man! In a league, we'll end up like H1Z1. It's that's not possible. People really do not understand how like hard it is to 100% kill a game. People don't get it. Like it is very hard to 100% kill a game. We're not even like a hundred people play it. I told you this weekend I queued up H1Z1. 
Bro, I had, there was, th I waited 40 minutes for a game to start. Welcome three to people, including me. So two others. Like, <laughs> that is so dead. It's insane. Well, the log games die, but they still have like 1,000 people play it. 3,000 people play it. And I was like fucking curious. I was like, <laughs> okay, how's the Twitch? How many, how many Twitch viewers does H1Z1 category have? Eight. Eight. Eight viewers. And there was three people streaming. I said, what the fuck? Well, they didn't kill H1Z1. The devs just never listened. Patches fucking suck. Like, and there was so many bugs that they would never fix. I wanted the fucking kill. 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 By the way, this Katarina player actually like matches his keyboard every every fucking every kill. It's like every every time he plays the game, it's so cringe. He flashes in place always. I was ready to back you up, bro. Flash down again. Cleanse down again. Just sitting AFK, are you mad? Wait, I just forgot. We also perma blue enemy bot sums as well. Wait, wait they're just disrespect. Is it, this is just disrespectful.
Why'd that freak take uh Thrush R or Thrush Body? It's stupid. Zoning. I'm not tanky at fucking up. They can end with this wave. here we can't lose fucking weak side all literally the entire game well, my team's just like fucking whacking their cocks over there in the fucking cornfield right doing just nothing camping top lane nothing we still like go even come out of lane ahead by the grace of god they don't deserve it and then I fucking have a game-winning Baron steal. Yeah, congrats, guys. Undeserved. Caitlyn's absolute molding. I don't know why. She got her lane camped. What is she mad about? I don't mean like playing with Sinna off Scion. I fucking hate this. I despise this goddamn champion for support. Oh, yeah, I played with one on Karthus earlier. The fucking Riot employee. Keep him. Sinna, a fucking fat fucking L. Absolute dog shit. Another Cinna, complete shit. This game, I, I played against Cinna. Guess what? Complete shit. I got a free win. What is Cinna's win rate? Bro, it's an ego pick. I don't care. It's these fucking filthy fucking support mains. And again, they're support mains. They fucking suck at the goddamn game. So why are they ego picking Cinna? This is probably the best one I've played with. 3-0-13. But this guy actually built full tank. Lock it. Wits end. Fucking useless. I don't forget what happened this game. First game of the day, we won. Was that five Sinnas I've played with today? Out of, what, 17 games? Last stream, Sinna. Why did they do this? Aids. Bro, if you pick anything with CC 
and I run it down, like, not, let's say Nautilus. And I run it down level one, right? Nautilus autos, cues, I get full passive and phase rush proc. You fucking twats. Leona, fucking Thresh, Pike, like anything. Holy shit, stop fucking locking in Cinna. Or fuck, no, it's my last game. Ready for my fucking ads and I'm out this bitch. I'm not bad for a Monday. I think we had one win trade. We only had one win trade. Which game was that? The fucking, our last Triss game. I won it. I didn't lose any. Bet. Anyway, that was my last game. I'm out this bitch. We'll be back at it tomorrow. Should be a little bit earlier-ish. Peace.